we just lost another 1.5! Yeah! Yeah! Yo, that is a... That is a rare sighting. The orange tunnel. You never see the orange tunnel. It's not a thing. Take that! Plants! <laughs> You came in hearing about asses. Hey man, you never know, right? Of course, movement two. But that's better than LO. Uh, yes, but most of my new stuff is a big reason why some things, why it's being a slow process. It, it, all, it always takes a while for new shit to be incorporated in runs. That's why a lot of speedrunners are lazy and refuse to add new things in, because it's it's a hassle. It changes your... It changes your success rate drastically. Mario 3 is already an extremely difficult game to be consistent at. So when you start adding new strats in every world, it makes every world just harder and harder. So, when you think about it, you're like, nah, just keep what I'm doing, whatever, it's like 20 frames, I don't care. But you're sacrificing a lot by doing that. So that's why I'm. That's why I decided at the beginning, before I even started grinding 100%, I gotta bring back some of the really hard strats. You have to. You have to, or else you're just wasting your time in the long run, right? Even though they're, even though it was a low pattern, I still have to wait for him to float through the water, which sucks. Which sucks. Door 3 plus door 3 is door 6, that's right. I went for the door 3 plus door 3, so I still technically, you know? Waiting for the floaters. Yeah, not a lot of people know that, but if the water tile on the overworld is there, then you'll do a water battle. If you look, look at the overworld, look at where the water tiles are. You can see them right there, I just passed one. There's three that I can see. So if you fight a Hammer Brother on that tile, there'll be water in the battle. If there's water in the battle, then the Hammer Brother has to float through the water until he goes off the screen. And the chest won't appear until everything's off the screen. So it's bad. You don't want to do any water battles. But, I have a choice. I got the speed though. Thankfully. So he's not gonna throw a third one. Ah! Come on! If I was lower! What a waste! God! If my swim was just a little bit lower, the odds of having him throw it like that is so stupid. But it happened. And then I got a mini marathon, and then I'm forced to go up here, which is even worse. Please go down and right. Just go down and right. Just spare me the trouble. Thank you. They spared me a little trouble, guys. They spared me a little. What's TAS? A 104. But TAS can, like, skip two minutes and shit. So, a, ta a Tasser can use a P-Wing in 7-4 and clip into the top right ceiling, which is like a pixel-perfect, frame-perfect, speed-perfect, sub-pixel-perfect trick, which is not possible for humans. Also, while doing it all off-screen and you can't see, and it saves about 2 minutes and like 14 seconds. So, that one trick alone applied to my PB would be 
a 108 14 so it's already almost at a 107 and the task is a 104 so there's there's little things that they can do that are dumb so at most jesus clip can only save me a movement of four so realistically i can only take one i could take like maybe three seconds off of the 15 seconds i'm gonna lose so the run's still really bad now but we're probably gonna die in jesus clip keep your fingers crossed though and i didn't even duck thank you for that input that that hype lead up <laughs> the hype for jesus clip didn't even duck <laughs> nice input <laughs> so stupid it was, it was pretty obvious to me that Mario just gave up. Mario was like, I'm not even ducking, Mitch. So, if, now if you could have just told me that after I messed up 5-2, I would have just reset, you know? But, you know, we tried. I'm feeling hot today with my movement, though, so we'll get a much better run going. Now, this P-Speed is RNG, so that's not my fault. But I can keep it going, that's no big deal. Gotta not focus so much on the small things. So much, dude. I should just stand there. I don't know why I jumped again. That waste of time. That's two resets, man. That's ten minutes wasted tonight on that boss. There's no need for it. No need whatsoever. It's because for some reason I panic and I think jumping is going to help me. But I don't need to jump. I can just stand there. Hundred percent no auto scroll run. That's like warpless. But it'd be impossible. It'd be impossible to do uh, no auto scroller run. The airships. <laughs> warpless no auto scroll run. Well, the run would end at one six. It'd be over. <laughs> uh, an all hammer brother run. I get all. Uh... An all hammer brother run would be, be like a shitty warpless run. It'd be like a shitty warpless run, essentially. Warpless is interesting because of the RNG behind it. I already made a new category, guys. It's called all collectibles. be a shittier version of all forts warpless is a better version of all forts but then all hammer brothers would be a shittier version of warpless warpless sits cozy in the middle nice and cozy all collectibles is a fantastic run guys i don't know why nobody else has ever wanted to do it i think it's fantastic SMB 100% is pretty much just warpless, right? Uh, all collectibles shouldn't be in the main categories, not until it gets popularized, but all forts should be in the main category. All forts should be a main category. Why not, man? It's been run at GDQ, everyone plays it, people like it, turn off TV and computer. Well, that, that's like a mom tip. That's like a parents from like 1960s tip. If you have a brain that races heavily and it's really hard to sleep because it's fucking loud and you're just thinking all the time and you're thinking fast, turning off shit doesn't help because you're just sitting there. 
You're just sitting there, thinking. Constantly. Turn off computer. Not in 1960, you frig. Oh, you're gonna get it, Kerbo. You gotta. If you're having trouble sleeping with a very and an overactive brain, you have to you have to figure out ways to slow your brain down before you go to bed. You gotta slow yourself down. That's the trick. That's how you get to sleep. And that's a lot of the sleeping problems that I have. However, as a streamer, naturally anyone who streams, you have to wind down after a stream. So as a streamer, you gotta wind down, wind down. <laughs> Annoyingly, alcohol does actually help you sometimes. You have like two beers, you get a little woozy, pass out pretty easily. Which sucks. I wouldn't... I wouldn't consider that as a viable option. <laughs> you guys remember that joke in Family Guy? I can't sleep, my tooth hurts. And his dad just throws a bottle of whiskey at him. Yeah, this will help you sleep. You want to know what really helps you wind down? Nature channels. Cooking shows, nature channels, history shows. Those will, I swear to god, those help wind down. Those are good wind downers. I use those. When I'm finished streaming, sometimes I'll sit, I'll continue sitting here at my computer. And I'll put on like, dude, the other night I put on some documentary about bees nests. Like, what? Just watching, you know. Hornets, hornets nest removal videos. You get tired, man. You get tired. Watch a documentary on, you know, World War One or something, or read a book. That shit helps too. I don't. I don't like reading books because if I read a book, I don't want to read a book in bed because I get cramps, man. I get uncomfortable. My neck hurts. I want to when I lay in bed. I like switching positions very often. So reading a book in bed sucks So if I read a book on the couch and I'm starting to fall asleep while I read the book By the time I put the book down and get get to my bed and lay down. I'm awake again. Pisses me off man. Pisses me off Oddly satisfying is pretty good But I never found those to be Can't do it unless I'm at the edge, man. No, I can't read in bed, man. I, I, it's just me, though. I mean, you could try reading in bed. When I read in bed, my neck starts to hurt, and I want to lay in different positions all the time. I like laying on my stomach. But if I lay on my stomach and read, then my neck hurts. Because you're not like this, you're like reading, and, and my back's out. I don't know. Very finicky when I'm sleeping or laying. Very finicky. Learn to fall asleep. You say that like it's like an actual thing. Like, what am I, a guru? I'm not gonna teach myself to forever fall asleep in a position so that I can read in bed. That sounds horrible. I mean, I'm sure after five years of training yourself, and you get in that rhythm, it, it works delightfully, I'm sure. But... You made it say seem so easy too. Oh, just learn to fall asleep in one position. <laughs> the the problem is falling asleep altogether. So like learning to fall asleep and learning to sleep in a position. Then master monk lifestyle. There you go. You see. Movement of three, fantastic. Just lost 0.5. Oh wait, the other hammer brother did a movement of one. I just lost one second. Awesome. <laughs> Should we just go for door three again and say fuck it? What the heck?
It took months. Just can't do it first try. <laughs> 